drawing a Sankey diagram in eSankey. The first steps. Well, drawing a Sankey diagram in eSankey is actually quite simple. All you need to know are two basic elements, the process and the arrow. Let's start with the process. You can click on the process symbol in the toolbar and position your mouse cursor where you want to place the process and click there. And you can do so repeatedly. Just click wherever you want to place a process symbol. Next is the arrow. Choose the arrow from the toolbar. Locate the mouse cursor on top of the start process and drag it to the destination process and it will snap to the destination process. Once again, click, drag and onto the target process. These uh, Sankey arrows are empty in the beginning so we have to add a flow. We can choose one of the entries from the entries window and drag it right onto the arrow. On the left side in the table of flows we can insert a flow quantity let's say 300 and the arrow will immediately show proportionally to the flow quantity entered. I'm going to add sand, let's say 500 and the 500 will be displayed on the Sankey arrow. I'm going to repeat that for water in the other arrow, insert it here and then let's say 1000. There you go. And when you hit enter or leave the field, the quantity will automatically be shown in the Sankey arrow. And you don't have to worry about getting the proportions and the width of the arrows right. eSankey will do that for you. So all you have to do is remember process, arrow, process, and a flow with its quantity that flows along the arrow. And of course, there's um, a lot more features you can you can try out to get the Sankey diagram, adjust its design and uh, get it to look nicely. And all those uh, features and options of eSankey uh, I will explain to you in the other videos of this tutorial series.